Hi there, in this quick video I'm going to show you how to rotate an image. Now if you've ever seen an image in an, either an ad or a website where somebody has uh, posted an image sideways, you know how annoying that is and, and there's a really simple way to get around that. And the best way to do that is to browse to your image by, and we're using Windows here, just go to computer and locate your image on your file and in this case I've put them in my stuff and I'm going to find that image now and let's see where that is 2012-11-19 so let me find 2012-11-19 and that's right here and my image that I know that I need to fix is image 100 now sometimes you can get a vertical shot the way you want to and sometimes the only way to get a real good vertical representation of something is to turn your camera and that's perfectly acceptable except that you end up with something like this and the best way to fix that with Windows is to browse to the file as I just did double click the file and then it'll open up in Windows Photo Viewer then down here you have left right arrows these little rotation buttons and each of those rotates the image a quarter of a turn either clockwise or counterclockwise and if you go the wrong way you just keep clicking it until you get to what you want this is what I want right here. So now you can see that the only way I could get the mast of this boat in here was to turn my camera sideways. Otherwise I'd have to stand way, way back and I'd get a whole bunch of side action that I didn't really want. So now let me go back over here and I'll show you how it's represented here. Again, it's represented as image number 100 laying on its side. So that's uh, all fine and well. We go back over here to the Windows Viewer, so you don't even have to close the Windows Viewer when you do this uh, and check back on that. I'm just doing that for demonstration purposes. So as soon as I close this, that image is going to turn. So I'm going to close it, and you can see that this image is now upright in my file system. So if I were to even close this file or do anything like that, it's now upright and it's going to stay upright. So if I go back and click on this and browse it again, you can see it's upright. Now you go back to the photo before, the photo after, and they're in landscape mode, which is the way they were intended to be. So anyway, this is very, very helpful and useful if you want to get your image up on a website right, rather than put it sideways and make your viewers crane their necks. So hope this has helped you out. If it has, please comment, rate, subscribe, and I'll see you in another video. Thank you.